general rule. So the first question 578 multiplies 161. So we will round off this 578 to the nearest 100. Yes. So uh, since we are rounding off to nearest 100, look at to the tens place. The number is greater than 5, that is 7. So 7 is greater than 5, we will round off this 578 to 600. Yes. So now uh, 161 to nearest 100. So look at the tens place here. The tens place, the number given is 6. And 6 is also greater than 5. We will round off it to nearest 100, that is 200, after number, that is after 100, after 1 is what? 2. So we have written here 200, here also 7 is greater than 5, so we have written 600. Now estimated product, so since it is multiplication, 600 into 200 is equal to, see look at here, 2 a, 6 into 2, 6 into 2 gives what? 12. 6 to the is 12 and how many zeros are here? 0 multiply is 0 multiply is 0. 2 zeros and here 2 zeros. Yes. So we will be writing at this 1 like 20,000. Yes. So next coming to our second question that is 5,281 into 3,491. So rounding off to the nearest to thousand. So since it is uh, thousand, we will round off it to our nearest uh, nearest thousand. So we will look to the hundreds place. So in the hundreds place, the number given is what two, and this two is less than five. So we will round off to the lower number only. Lower number is what five thousand. We will round off it to five thousand and three thousand four hundred ninety-one. So we are rounding off it to nearest hundred. So, if you are rounding off to nearest 100, just look at to the, uh, look to the tens place. The tens place number given is what? It is greater than 5. So, if it is greater than 5, round, uh, round off this 491 to, it is greater than 5 here. 9 is greater than 5. Yes, 91. So, look at here. So, it is greater than 5. We round off it to the upper number that is 3500. So now, estimated product will be 5000 into 3500, that is, so now we will just do uh, 35, 5 into 35, yes, so let us do 35 into 5, 5, 5 is 25, 5 is 15 and 17, let's do 17, so 1, 75 and how many zeros are here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So let us put the commas properly. So now it is 1 crore 75 lakhs. Estimated product of this question. So next, coming to our third question, rounding of 1291 to the nearest 100. So we are rounding off to nearest 100 here. So look at to the tens place. The number given is what? Greater than 5. So if it is greater than 5, 91 is greater than 5. So, let us round it off to the nearest 100. That is uh, upper number. So, if it is greater than 5, we are rounding off it to what upper number. That is 1300. Next, 592. We are rounding off to the nearest 100. So, 92 is greater than, uh, 9 is greater than 5. So, we are rounding it off to the upper number. That is 600. So, 1300 into 600. So 13 sigza. 13 sigza is what? 78. Yes? 78 and multiple zeros. Right? As it is. So it becomes 7 lakhs 80,000. So this is the estimated product here. So now 9,250. Coming to our fourth question. 9,250 into 29. Surrounding of 9250, the nearest thousands, that is what? Uh, we are rounding off to nearest thousands, so look at to the hundreds place. In the hundreds place, the number given is 2, and 2 is less than 5, so we will round off to the lower number, that is 9000. And 29, rounding off to nearest to tens, 9 is, uh, 9 is greater than 5, we will round off it to the upper number, that is 30. So 9000 into 30. Now 9 into 3 is what? 9 3 is 27 and 
zeros, three zeros and one zero. So it is two lakh seventy thousand. So this is our estimated product here. So thank you everyone for watching my video. If you have any doubts regarding this topic, you can just put your comments below. And thank you for watching my video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.